Today's adventure begins as the recording of this. It is Friday. TGI, uh, January 12th, 2024. The opening day of Epcot's Festival of the Arts 2024 edition. Very dreary, overcast, at least at this moment, to 11 a.m. While I do like all the festival Epcot, festivals Epcot presents, this, one of my favorites. If I had to put them in some sort of order, I would say this and Festival of the Holidays are kind of tied neck and neck with my favorites, followed by Flower and Garden, and last, probably be Food and Wine. It is officially raining. 71 right now. I could bring my umbrella, but I'm gonna chance it and not bring it. Yeah, 71, cloudy all day. It's gonna get up to 78 around two though. 411. Thank you. A little hazy. I'm gonna walk. And maybe I'll take the tram. I never take the tram. I'll take the tram. I think I'm gonna take the tram. I never take the tram here. I'm gonna take the tram. On behalf of the driver and I, would like to welcome to Epcot. Epcot will remain open until nine o'clock today. If you're hoping the magic can extend, we do have our fireworks show, Luminous the Symphony of Us, that's also at nine. If you'd like a ride back to your car and Dory, just make sure you're within our tram loading zone. Didn't go too far, only like 100 yards. But I don't think I've taken the Epcot driver tram since they brought the Epcot trams back. Welcome everyone, Adam DeWoo here. I'm inviting you to join me, shall you? For Epcot Center's opening day of Festival of the Arts 2024. Now I know the Starbucks in the, oh, check it out. There goes another Monterey. I know Starbucks inside is gonna be really busy, so I'm gonna go with the Joffrey's hack. There's no one in line for Joffrey's. Now I know I'm gonna be eating probably a little more than I should today, because of these festivals, that's the case. So I, I didn't get a latte today. I just went with a regular coffee with just one cream, one sugar. But I'm definitely gonna be trying some food. Maybe not all the food, but I'm gonna try a couple food options. Spaceship Earth already at a 35 hey, minute wait. It's getting really tough not to call it mouse gears. It's technically called Creations Shop now. And the line doesn't look too bad. I'm sure earlier it was really long, but right now it's kind of a walk up. Ooh, I like how Figment is pretty much represented on everything now. 2024 Epcot International, International Festival of the Arts. I think I forgot to add in the International Festival of the Arts. It's gonna be looping around World Showcase, which I guess would make it international. A little word, world traveling. I'm gonna to do today. Oh, this is new too. This had nothing to do with the festival, but I haven't seen these before. How right, you managed to, to get one of the popcorn buckets yes. right here. How long do you have to wait for it? Well, we yeah. got in like no right. time at all. We just did the mobile order like you do for food. Okay. It worked the same way. We got figment from three. You hijacked figment. Yeah, we got figment yeah. from three years ago sitting yeah. in the car. Cool. And uh, we're excited. Are you doing videos or what do you do? What do you do? What do, you do? Oh, yeah, we got them all. Yeah, yeah what's your, give, give a little shout out. What is it? Years. years of ears. Say it one more time. Years of ears. Years of ears. Yes. Years. Years of ears. Years. Yes. Years of ears. Check them out, guys. Yes. And you can see you're gonna do a review of this. Indeed. Yes. All right. There you go. Yeah. Make sure shut. Let me see it. Thank All right. You. So you got the spirit jerseys over here again. Lots of. You also have this T-shirt here, which has music, a pencil, a music note, a pencil, and a paintbrush with figment as well, and even more figment here. Now I've kind of decided really the only thing I'm going to be really buying bulk of anything anymore is going to be postcards, Disney pins, and magnets because they don't take up a lot of space. I mean, there will be exceptions, but I'm not going to buy every every little thing that there possibly is. Hey, what's this down here? Oh, it's like a little plushie right here. It's a Disney munchling, and then there's also like the little water bottles and coffee mugs over here as well. Look at that. There we go. I do like date stamps up, but I want to find I want to find the pens. Also, these have been out for a couple months, but I really like these figment ears right here. If I was a if I was an ears person, this would definitely be a go to. These sold out a couple months ago, and they've kind of they've restocked them, obviously. But I love this. Ooh, what is this over here? This says oh, it's the figment. It's that new uh, little golden book that came out a couple weeks ago. The figment golden book. Figment in a frame. He was framed. He was framed. 
All right, these are the event pens. There is a Mickey event pen with a little paint palette. Of course, you got the Figment one. I'll probably definitely be buying the Figment one, and then there's this one. So you got Warren. So I got the keychain. Also got the one Figment one that opens there. I'm gonna get this one. Out. Okay. And there's also this T-shirt here. There's also some limited edition pass holder pens right here. So I think I'm gonna get this one too, which is uh, has all the different World Showcase countries on it. 2024, and this is just for four APs, as stated right here. And then around this corner is the pass holder T-shirt. All right, there's like a little, it's almost like almost like a Christmas ornament of some size, or even though it's way past Christmas. There's just like a point ornament there with figment in the frame also. Oh wait, it says only two per guest, Greg. Oh. Only two per two per guest. Can only buy two figments. But I only want one, so I think I'm good. Ben, did you get did you buy one? I'll, I'll buy I'll buy one and then you can have two. You might be the coolest guy in here, Ben, because you have shades <laughs> yeah. on inside yeah, course, and you have a Captain always. EO shirt and you're holding figment. I am the trifecta. I'm not full up guy. <laughs> Alright, put your glasses back on. What what was it like this morning here at uh what's it not mouse gears? What's it called now? Creations. Creations. I, I keep calling it mouse gear, but what it was, was it like? like dude, there was people just like hoarded around every around the, around the Ewoks? Not necessarily the Ewoks. We're gonna pretend that there's This is at fans. rope drop, right? This was yeah, fairly yeah, yeah. close to rope drop. Drop. All right. Just like people, like it was like Black Friday shopping. Oh wow! Just, okay. I saw, Just, but the Ewoks didn't get any love. The Ewoks, yeah. The, yeah. I feel like studios might be sold out of Ewoks. Yeah, yeah. But now it's still pretty full in here, but definitely not. I saw a madhouse. I saw people with carts, like you know, like uh, like yeah. strollers, Grill. full of merch, stuffed with merchandise. Yeah, right. that is definitely old school. I spotted that from afar, right there. <laughs> nice. Good to see it's you, like man. Seeing a rock star shirt, right? <laughs> The shirt? Yeah, I, I love the shirt. When I had my shirts in a, when a band and I saw my face on a yeah. shirt, that's kind of odd. That's awesome. I haven't sold those in like five years. Wow. That's when we bought it. Five years ago. I love it. What's your name? Peter. Nice to see you, Peter. It's a pleasure to meet you. All right, the paint art wall. You have the paint distribution over here where you go and get your brush and your paint, and you can, expression section can paint the wall. And at the end of Festival of the Arts, the thing will be com completely finished. All right, so you, pick, you just pick one color, is that what you do? Grace will hand you the color. Okay. And then once you get to the wall, you'll paint five squares okay. of that color. All right, sounds good. Go as tall as you can. As tall as I can. I'm number four. So these are the four different ones that are going to be completed? Yes. All right, so. Excellent. So the first one's got the monorail on there, Imagination Pavilion. Now the sun's coming out, so I have donned my sunglasses as well. I just don't have eyeballs. Ben's gonna help me film a little bit while I, he's already painted, so I'm oh, gonna, yes. what number did you get? I got number I, I was just about to say, I had number four. Yeah. So we're like we're twinsies today. We're matching. We have matching glasses and matching paint. All right, number four. Wait, I lost track of it. Where was it? Oh, right here. should all be right here. Number four. I think I might go down the road. I think you have to do four in order. You can't skip you can't skip numbers. You gotta do is it four or five? Uh, your number? Your number is four. I did three. How many am I supposed to paint in a row? Four? Um, I think you I think you can get away with four. I think four and four. I think you can get away with four. I think two, between three and five. Alright, so I'm gonna go right here. Oh, it's gotta be four because we only they only have four in a row on all the colors. Oh there we go. There we go. So I'm going gray, just like the sky is right now. The song is the sky is blue and all the leaves are green, but now the sky is gray and the wall is not green. I don't know what I was going with. That. <laughs> all right, paint brush in here. And then this is going to be the final resort. Oh, okay. That's the final result. I, I got. Mine. I'm over here, so I'm probably just may have done some of the guardians area. All right, I got some paint on the hands. I'm going to go try to wash it off. Going past the little construction update over here. Oh, that is a thing of beauty right there, going past the Imagination Pavilion. I was just mentioning to myself and to Ben that they had not seen a monorail go by in probably about 15 or 20 minutes. There's a little lull in the monorails, but got, got it, got it on film. All right, this is looking down at the paint wall. You can see all that construction that's happening down over there. Now, in years past, there's someone waving over there, but over here, the paint wall used to be over there in years past but now you can't go around that way. They have blocked that off. For years, you can be able to walk that way while the construction is happening, and they have rerouted the construction section. So now the wall's over here. Oh yeah, perfect timing. This was not planned. There it goes. 
the Monterey. All right, there's a couple. There's another little display over here. You can get photos like this here. Pigment of imagination, a pigment of figment, you could say, right there. And then around here is the front of the Festival of the Arts logo as well. I think everyone is out here today. This life of ours, Tim Tracker. And this life of ours. That's what I said. I said, this life of ours, Tim oh, Tracker. I you forgot. No, I said, I said it at the beginning, though. I mumble. I mumble, though. Look at this outfit you're wearing. I am. Oh, should I, should I show it? Yeah, you got it. Here we go. I'll get in the middle. You guys get on either side. There we go. That's cute. Yeah. Thank you. What should I try here today? What's, what is, what? Both things at this booth are brand new. Both things? This year. So you guys gotta try them and let yeah. me know. What are you gonna try? I don't know. I'm trying for this art first. Yeah, you don't even. It? Are you gonna show it off? Sure, look at All this. Right. Let me see what you got. Oh, oh that's nice. Cool. That is nice. But they yeah, went up in price. That's not a Stanley. $55 now. This is Disney's version of the Stanley? Yeah. How much is this? 55. Wow, a Stanley's only 49. Porksicle is a local company. Oh, so, so you're supporting the local. That's yeah. better, right? Yeah, small business. I like that. And then um, the pen? I got that one. Oh, I didn't get that one. That one that's the flip open one. Did Can you, I see that one? Yeah, flip it open. I got the AP one. I'm sorry. There you go. Make every day a work of art. There's four pens. I had to choose two, so I I didn't get that one, but I like that so one. So you got I got the art one too. I got two, and then you got that one. I got that one. Yeah, I like that it spins around oh, like sorry, that. Sorry, showcase on there. Yeah, it's really cute. I'm a sucker for merch. <laughs> Me too. Did you get the annual pass? Why is that um, funny? <laughs> did you get the T-shirt? I didn't get the shirt, but I like it because it reminds me of the one they sell in the Imagination Pavilion that has the Epcot oh, yeah. Center on it. Yeah. <laughs> I like them big because I wear them like a dress. This is a Diz Life of Art merch hall, right here. I like this. This is, this is a hall that I'm gonna hide from hubby. Oh. He's <laughs> <laughs> gonna get hit what in the garage for a little bit. What if he watches this video? That's true. I won't he tell him. We're like, wait a minute. <laughs> Right. Wait, been this is new? Yeah. I love it's the like, Ben there like series. The Starbucks cup. The Starbucks cup. Mm -hmm. yeah. Are right, you going to do the unveiling? Ready? Let's do it. What is this? Whoa. Okay. Is that pigment on there? Yes. Pigment. This oh, is nice. Take my money, please. Look. I need that. And the inside is purple. I like that. And the test track That's vehicle's sweet. on there. And then ready? Look. Ratatouille. Look at this. Around the back. Olaf. Oh, the, the land? Even, yeah, check that out. That's cool. Wait, but look. Journey of Water. They added Moana. Yep. I might have to get that. Is this is this World Showcase Lagoon? That is. Oh, oh, yeah. I see a hot dog at Disney. That's what your chest, what your uh, page is, right? Hot dogs hot at Disney. Hot dogs at Disney. Do you want the uh, festival hot dog report? Yes. Give me the festival hot dog report. There are zero hot dogs oh. at the Festival of the Arts. No, you're, you're lying. There's Except one right this here. one. It's it, it's definitely a BYOD event. BYOD. <laughs> What about uh, condiments? Can you add a condiment on your own it's BYOD? Too messy. It's hard enough bringing these things around with me all over the uh, parks and rides and whatnot without yeah. condiments. I just put you my sunglasses them back on. Like no, put, put them back, back on. on. Put them back on. The action shot. The action shot? Yeah. Oh, I like this shirt. Where'd you get that? D23, uh, Destination D23. Oh, nice. Are you going D23 this year? or yeah. should I? Use... Tickets on sale March 26th. I'm gonna, I can't wait. Me neither. I'll be there. Oh, nice. Got the monorail going by there again. Gonna head over into the Odyssey to Figment's Inspiration Station over here. And like I said, I got the Festival Passport. And this event is kind of short-lived. It only goes from January 12th, which is today, till February 19th, so about five weeks. I think it might be the shortest of, uh, of most of the, the festivals. Look, there's even a Figment flip book inside. Met up with a couple other creators. What's the name of your channel? Oh, Theme Park Foodies. Theme Park Foodies. You yes. were saying, as I was filming that, that this is also one of your favorite festivals at Epcot. Yes, I think we were agreeing. Festival of the Holidays and this one were our two favorites. Okay. Two yeah. shortest, but two best. I think about both about five weeks, right? So, give or take? Yeah. yeah. This one actually ends on my birthday. Okay, well, you're gonna have a happy birthday on the last day of Festival yeah, of the Arts. They have a special thing at the end for Aladdin. Yeah, there's right? an Aladdin like special going on for the anniversary of Aladdin. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, right. I will right, check your guys' channel out. Thanks Hope a lot. Hope you have a good Pleasure Festival of the Arts. Course. Remind, say your channel one more time for everyone. Uh, theme Park Foodies. Theme Park Foodies. I'm guessing you do a lot of eating. Yes. Uh, too Just much. Too much eating. I like that. What is this? You want to give you a review on this? Let me give you a little spoiler. Oh yes. Yeah, so that was the tostada over at the Mexico booth. All right, okay. I'm getting a review of what's inside the Odyssey. Well, the mica was just in there. Give me a talk about. Tell me what's in there. They give me a spoiler. They basically like give this a uh, little nod to the Imagination Pavilion from okay. the past. Did you see the buckets? The popcorn buckets? I did. There's a nice little line. There's a nice little display of it. I'm gonna um, go check that there's out. There's a few other things in there. Some surprises with art. Uh, but it's it's pretty nice. It's, it's all and virtual. Q. inside there reminds me of the old Imagination Pavilion. Yeah, oh, they got the music playing. Um, I'm not sure if it's from the old Imagination or not, or if it's a new take. It definitely has a nostalgic feel. Yeah. 
but the lighting in there is um, Michael Jackson could fit in there. I, I will say. Really? So Ben Lawrence like wearing the Captain EO shirt would fit right in being in there. Well, I was just about to say, I think the last time I saw you yes. was when we shut down EO together, and I was probably <laughs> wearing the same shirt, so you probably think I only have one shirt. I almost wore that shirt, so that was Oh, we could have matched. I know. But I ran into, are you, are you, do you <laughs> still go by Big Fat Panda or just big, Panda? Pa fun. Big Fat Panda, Panda, doesn't matter. It's all good. I want, Which do you prefer? Panda, because BigFatPanda.com, I think, for me, is the website, and it's from Kung Fu Panda, but I think Panda just sounds better. I don't know. You just like me called Panda. I have a lot of husbands come up to me and say, excuse me, my wife just thinks your name like this. Okay. Before they approach you because they're scared, and someone's like, I go, Excuse me? And he's like, Oh, sir, I'm sorry. And I'm like, no. I've always called you Big Fat Panda, but I'll start calling you Panda. You know where it comes from, right? I thought Kung you Panda. made it up. No, if you watch Kung Fu Panda. It's not a Disney thing? It's not Disney, it's DreamWorks. So Dream Disney should buy DreamWorks so that I can right, just no. rest. But no, the, at the end of Kung Fu Panda, the lion says to me, You're just a big fat panda. He goes, No, I'm like, No, he says, You're a big fat panda. He goes, No, I'm not. I'm the big fat panda. And he pulls me. So give me the one thing I should try here. Well, I want to try the, the grilled cheese and tomato soup. I'm in it. I'm, I'm gonna do it. That. I don't know where it is though. I'm gonna find it. All right. And I'm gonna do it for you. Let me know. One day we should do a food review. I don't do very good food reviews. Basically, I just eat something and go. Yeah, no, that's that was, exactly that what was I okay. Want. I don't want a good food review. But I want good. an Adam the Wu food review. Now I discovered this lit up. Jackie super enthused yeah. ended up. How much you cough up for that? Oh my god, too much. How much? Thirty dollars. That's actually not that bad. Is it? I bought two okay, pens. Me feel forty. I spent forty bucks for two pens. They're nineteen ninety nine each. Okay. And this you includes pop. This includes popcorn right there. It includes popcorn. Figment comes out. I haven't tried to open it yet, but I remember my mom like. Plus, think about the lanyard. It opens. The lanyard would probably cost you ten bucks on its own, ten or twenty bucks on its own. Ten dollars. So. Ten for Figment. Ten for the building. Yeah. Theme park map. What, what kind of treats are you gonna try today? What kind of food options? Um. So my favorite thing is a sushi donut in Japan. I might get that. That's what I get every year. Okay. I'm not sure what else. I might try to some new things. All right. I'm not sure. The food I feel like at Good. Festival of the Arts is prettier than. Good. I'm you know what I mean? What's your favorite festival of all the Epcot Flower festivals? Garden. Really? It's my birthday festival. Okay. And I like the food. What's best. your least favorite? That's a tough one. Least favorite of the four. I feel like food and wine. Yes. Food because and wine's the worst. The same. Yes. It goes on for I way agreed. too long. Yep. And it's less like the yeah. industry. I agree. We are on the same page with that. Yes. Yes. This and Festival of the Arch are my favorites, and then Flower and Gardens, like third, and then way in the backdrop is Food and Wine. Yeah, Food and Wine is, it used to be a favorite, like, years ago. Yeah. Now. You're just waiting for me to hit stop, right? No, I'm actually waiting to show you that it lights up. It's oh, kind of hard to find a, like a yeah. dark spot, but over here by Maybe the payphone. Maybe old... Figment wants to make a pay, a payphone call. I don't want to touch that. It yeah, looks don't touch very that, right? germy. Okay, here we go. Look at that. It lights up. Ooh. Okay. That is pretty cool. Right? Now, and then you could change. I could see it lit up a little bit when you were lighting it up inside. Yeah. But I kind of like it next to the payphone a little bit better. It's like a good good spot Classic. right there. Who do you think Figment would call? Um, I think, I it, think he'd call Dreamfinder. Or Ooh. Bert Eisner. Oh. Yeah. Ugh. He no longer has Iger or Chapek or Chape mm. on speed dial anymore. He has no one to count on anymore. Poor no. Figment. Well, none of us do. Let's be honest. You are you're a full AP right there. You are a full-on pass hole right now. I mean, uh, pass holder right now. Listen. Right. Okay. Look at this. I know this is a compliment or an insult. No, it's okay. a compliment. I am too. I even have a, a magnet true. that says pass hole on it. Yes, you do. Yes, yes you do. All of us not, are. Not Jackie. You. Me. Ben Lawrence. Lawrence. No, that's that's Jackie. That's not Ben Lawrence. Lawrence. It's Jackie. With Lawrence. That's my mom's name, so it's really Lawrence. weird. Lawrence. Lawrence. Yes. April. April. And it's April. April right there. April's here too. Is your last, last name, name Lawrence, though? Lawrence. Probably not. Would you consider yourself a pass hole? Oh, yes. Yes, it's, <laughs> not, it's not a negative hole. thing. Yes. You have an annual pass? I, I, I know. Oh, you're not then. You're not in the group. Get out of here. Be gone. Be gone. You're a mass hole, though. You're a mass hole. All right, we're going over towards a certain area where there's going to be a performer is going to be doing a what performance at one and a performance at four, which I have never seen at the festival. I think he was here last year. He's been here in, in previous years. So I'm gonna kind of watch him before heading into World Showcase, starting from the Mexico Pavilion. So after we get done watching this, we're gonna end up heading around World Showcase and check out some food booths and check out some art booths and really kind of dive deep into the Festival of the Arts, which is awesome. Festival of the Arts, baby! It has begun! Yeah! Thank you so much. I'm artist Trevor Carlton. I'm out of breath.
He's working hard. All right, usually Donald meets over here, but right now Donald in the in person is not over here. But there is a painting of Donald. He's number one. I wonder if Donald drew that. Probably. So far, it was raining when I first walked in, but it hasn't started raining again again since then. Hopefully, it gets subsided because I did not bring my umbrella. Oh, this is kind of neat. This is all the Disney characters in San Francisco on the streetcars, and you got the Golden Gate there. Yeah, that's pretty awesome. All right, I'm getting my first item. Tim was saying this is a new item at Gourmet Landscapes. It is a roasted beet with goat cheese, lettuce, blackberry gastrique. Dang, I should have got the risotto right there. Is that like a... I like that. Wait, is that rice? Yes. Man, I should have got some of that. Tim talked me into the beets. Like, yeah, duh. I didn't talk to any beets. You said the beets are new. The beets are new. I want something new. I don't want something old. The risotto is an age, age old tradition. Are you from St. Cloud? Nice. Technically, no, that's where I live now. Look at this. I have an STC tattoo. St. Cloud. St. Cloud are proud right there underneath the magic. Did you say St. Cloud in the crowd? St. Cloud proud. Oh, okay. Yeah, this is definitely a wonderful presentation here. Look at this. It's got the goat cheese. It has the little mushroom stems right there. It's got the pecans. This is very artistic. And it's always appropriate at any of these festivals to use a tabletop of a trash can. At the same time. Oh, hey, how's it going? See, the punch you probably seen coming in the popcorn buckets. Oh, yeah. 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 So, mm -hmm. so, you guys got the beets? Yep. We're going to get we the, got the beets the and the risotto. Yeah. So, yep. That's a, it's a go go song. Yeah, we got the beet. Yeah, we got the beet. Got the beets. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> got the beets. <laughs> yep. So, well, have you had anything else yet? The, the steak and the, This is actually really good. Uh, pork over there really good. I like the goat cheese mixed with the well, beef. This is our first food because we hang out in the front for a little while to do guardians and other stuff. So we'll first, with a little bit of goat cheese. Are these beets also? Yeah, they're golden beets. <laughs> oh, you know what? I already had one. It was good. I mean, if you're a fan of beets, I am. This is where it's at. The goat cheese is good. The goat cheese has like a little bit of a sweet bite to it. It's kind of everything. Golden beef, goat cheese, and mushroom. Which mm. one do you like better? I like I like that beef better. The golden beef? Yeah. yeah, I'm disappointed that I've ate all of them. Oh no. The pecans do add like a nice little crunch too. Not getting a huge blackberry. Right, this booth is by a guy named Rob Kaz. I really like this Jay Fatty as in front of Mr. Toad right here. And you got Jiminy Cricket in front of Magic Kingdom. A little stitch. Yeah, he's all he's gone full Disney right there. You didn't know you really didn't know the event was going on today? No, today was supposed to be my like, rest day where I worked yeah, out. Yeah, yeah, no, today is uh the first day of the Festival of the Arts. You didn't know that today I didn't was the know. Yeah, Did yeah. you not see me when I waved to you in the beginning? I was so like overwhelmed. I'm like, hi Tim, I gotta figure out what I'm doing. Like it was yeah, yeah. I didn't know. Oh, yeah. Well welcome to the knowledge. <laughs> welcome to the Festival of the Arts. <laughs> <laughs> Please enjoy the art. Jojo everyone. Yeah. Oh, I like you almost did like an Elvis thing. He's good. You hey. should do it. What? Do yeah, it. you're too young for Elvis. Do you remember you wrote Elvis, right? I I could be Elvis. You I know, haven't seen could you? I know I, I know Elvis. Yeah, I yeah. saw the new movie. I have not seen the new movie. This is a really long line. What did you want me to get, Tim? Over here. Oh crap. Hey guys. Hey, what is this? Another Adam the Woo shirt? How about it, man? That's the How second Adam it? the Woo shirt I've seen Dude, today. I have looked for you forever. What's your name? Logan. Nice Robert. to meet you. You have a channel? Uh, Jarvel 5. Dude, Say it again. Jarvel 5. Jarvel. -L -L Shout out to the. To give you. Thank you. What does Jarvel man? mean? Man, when I was a little kid, <laughs> we had sure. like a uh, superhero group. Oh, okay. We had more J's in it, like Jordan, Jake, Josh. So instead of Marvel, we named oh, it was the Jarvel. Yeah, okay. So that's it. Let me get that makes sense. Little... What was your superpower? I would name Spike back. I had spikes that would come out of my back. Okay. <laughs> Pick them up with my sword. I like that. It's a deep cut. You got the pa you got the paging Mr. Morrow hat on. Yeah, too. I haven't seen that. him today either. Yeah. He's probably here. I'm sure we're all here. Jojo's here. Tim's here. Morrow's here. Thank you. All we're all here. Look at that. Wow. Nice, yeah. man. Yeah. Cool. These are legit. Awesome, man. Yeah. Thank you. Thanks, man. Yeah. Jarvel. Jarvel 5. J5. Jarvel 5. We ended up shortening it to There's J5. another J5, Johnny 5 from Short Circuit. Oh, yeah. Who's Johnny? Classic, mid 80s. Yep, yep. You just stayed at that house. Like, that's you watch my videos. All <laughs> you actually know the record. Many of years. I liked, I haven't sold that like, shirt in like six I, years. Yeah. I got Old it school. like. <laughs> you shut down your shop like a year later, I think. Yeah. And I got it like right before. You got one of the last ones. Nice to meet you. Yeah, these are Spicoli slip-ons from Fast Times. Yeah. Checkerboard slip-ons. 
Yeah. Yeah. I call them Spicolis. Before my time, I'm 30. You never seen Fast Hives? I think I've seen. You've it, never like, seen Fast Hives at Ridgemont High? I think I've seen. It. That's your homework assignment tonight, J5. Got it. You got it. Got it. 100%. <laughs> There's a scene in there, a pool scene, that I remember very well as a teenager. <laughs> you, remember, you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> <laughs> JoJo does it. He's never even seen Elvis. Nope. Have you seen Fast seen Times? No, I have what a lot of. I got a lot of holes now. <laughs> you guys have seen Fast Times. Time. All right, you, you have it, but you're playing it I've off like you have. Of, <laughs> a lot of 80s movies. Like right, what's your favorite 80s movie? Back to the Future. Part Name two, six actually. 80s movies. Part two is better than one. All right. I like the futuristic. Delorean. I got you. I love the futuristic flying Delorean. That's All my right. favorite car. Dream car. Right. Dream car. Hundred percent. Right. All right, nice to meet you guys. Yeah. Right. I gotta, I gotta ask Resort TV One here what I should get from this pavilion to eat. Have you eaten anything? We haven't eaten here yet. We ate in Germany and loved it. Okay. And we're heading that way. We have we're, We started over in Canada. We're doing the Canada side. The right side. Yeah. Is that the right side? I mean. Or the correct side, you mean? Go left. You can go whichever way. What do you think of this? Are you, are you happy with the thirty dollars you spent on that? I I'm, really am. It's pretty awesome. I mean, it lights and it up. lights up. <laughs> and you can take Figment out. Take the shirt. Oh yeah, he comes out. Yeah. All right. Well, have fun, you guys. Don't eat too much. Thank we'll try. You. Good to have see you both. Too. Oh, I went with painter vibes. Also, France. France. Um, I am a rendition of Mickey from a video game called Epic Mickey, where he was a painter. Um, so it's my rendition of Black Professor of the Earth. Yeah. <laughs> All right, I got some uh, fellow vloggers here. You want to give a, your channel a shout out real quick? Yes, we are Florida Fabulous on YouTube. And then I am the Almost Daily Dead on YouTube. Okay. Florida Fabulous on YouTube. Yes, All right. Thank you. Happy Festival of the Arts. Thank you. I will. Nice to meet you both. Now look who it is over here. Give me give me what I should be getting here at the at this particular Ouch. event. What should I get? Ouch! No, come on. Be <laughs> positive, Tom. Empanada, the Bronte Vivito, right? The returning oh, stuff, I always like the, the, the empanada. The empanada. I'm gonna get some seafood from here, some salmon. Funnel cake every year, right? Yeah. That, funnel, that chocolate funnel cake this year is great. Okay. And I have to say, I enjoy your guys' little camaraderie in the new podcast. Oh, we're getting a free so, plug? you're getting a free plug right here. Adam, yeah, Adam I'll bill you later. Nicest, I'll send you a bill Adam's later, the Tom. Nicest person in the entire community. That is. He get out of here. I wouldn't go that far. <laughs> I was about to say, when you said Wait. the nicest person, I went like this. And then what? Here's, here's the worst one. Oh. No. I'm the kindest. Wow. Yeah. Tom you're, Corliss is I'm calling you out. The kindest. Get out of here. I've never heard Tom call anyone out ever. Yeah. It's, <laughs> it's, it's a rarity. I'm getting the duo, Tim. Oh, thank you. What am I getting, Tim? The duo. The duo to salmon. Okay. Uh, All right. I'm gonna get that then. The hot and cold. All right. Where'd you? What are you getting? The chocolate. Which ones did I order? You ordered the mousse. Yeah. And the puff pastry. I will say, this is a pretty long line. We've probably been waiting in this little area for probably 30 minutes. I was just saying that. 35 it's minutes? It's been like two minutes. What's him saying? You got a camera guy now? I a camera guy, but he's fair. He's really nice. All right. The fire the best. Do you always film for JoJo? Not always. Not. All right. He's got you today. He didn't even know this event was going on today. Ferris Films over. Come on, man. You're your right, got to self promote here. Well, look, it's cool. I'm a filmer. I'm a filmer. Millions and millions of likes. Yeah. Anyway, <laughs> we've been here for only two minutes. Two hours. Shortest line of the, Shortest line of the park. It's been about a half hour. <laughs> no, this is worse than Guardians. Okay, behind the scenes here, on how they're making it. It's a tutorial. Ah ouais? Oh putain! Oh putain! C'est magnifique! Je suis Picasso, les mecs! You know, Pablo Picasso? Pablo Picasso! Pablo Picasso! Pablo Picasso! I'm an auto Ah, a great Frenchman! Pablo Picasso! Pablo Picasso! Anthony is now Picasso! Pablo Picasso! Yeah, he, he the greatest French artist ever. Well, that's Tim's uh, sweet item. I got the savory. Right there. Mine's all in the same place. Monet or Monet? Monet. 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 I like artists. Monet. Yeah. Thank you. We have the Monet. Monet. It's the Monet team. This looks, Monet team. This looks awesome. A piece of art. Pretty sure Mayweather will be upset if we call this the Monet team. Can I pour you something? Oh, thank you. <laughs> Thanks so much. She got a little string off the plate. All right. Like again, you know you're at Epcot when you're eating on top of trash cans. 
So JoJo's doing a weird thing where he orders what the person in front of them ordered? Yeah, so whatever the person got, I'm just getting. So it's like a little surprise. The smallest bread bowl I've ever seen in my entire yeah, life. Yeah, you? inside of it. Y'all got the fancy uh, arty stuff. Adam is here, he got the, this is the duo, so there are two salmon dishes that you can get. You got the- uh, Hot the, and cold. The, yeah, the hot and the cold. The smoked salmon with the biscuit. Should That's I try what it? you're doing, yeah, yeah. Is this the hot or the cold? I don't know. This was, got the smoked salmon. He got the duo for $14.75, so it's a little bit of each. That's but good. you get them one at a time, it's $7.95. So that one is salmon mousse, smoked salmon, dill, and a flaxseed biscuit. I like it. Cold. That's what it said underneath. I'm glad I got this. It was like a 30 minute wait to get it. It was pretty tasty. Worth it? Yeah, but yeah. No, but yeah. <laughs> it wasn't worth the half hour, but worth the price. Don't ask me what it cost. And then, and then what did I get? I got this was mine was nine twenty five. This is an expensive booth. <laughs> Aren't they all? No, this one's exceptionally expensive. And it has one of the longest lines. It must be good. People love the pan, the uh, the, the brie bread. Jojo's here. He got the hey brie bread. Yeah. This is like the fan favorite apparently, and this cost nine dollars and ninety-five cents. Expensive. Expensive. For a little tiny piece of bread, ten bucks, and some cheese. It looks nice on the inside. They just call it molten because like molten lava is supposed to look like lava there. Yeah. Oh, it's warm. You got stuff in your beard. I make a mess when I eat. All right, from here I'm gonna continue around World Showcase Lagoon. Gonna do the full loop. See what else I can get into. See some art. Eat some treats. Eat some, not treats, but eat some savory foods. All right, over where there's quite a cavalcade of artistic booths over in this section. You can see there's some over there, some over there. I got Mr. a lot of good Mr. Toad stuff out here, a lot of good orange bird stuff. Some of the stuff is so good. You got Jungle Book, you got Tangle, you got Rapunzel up here. Madame Leota Mansion. All right, passing Morocco now. I'm gonna make my way over to the Japan Pavilion and get the sushi dish for the festival. All right, this artist is Buckley right there. See some of the haunted mansion with the Muppets, which is really cool. We got some villains, we got Cruella and Ursula. We got the slipper. Oh, check, take a look at this. This is neat. Going over the bridge there with mansion off in the distance as well. Hollywood Tower, you got Mickey and Pluto. Of course, a lot of Disney art, Star Wars art. Anything that has to do with the Fran, oh, check it out, Mr. Toad's Wild Ride. That's great. Here's a good assortment of Star Wars stuff in here. And this festival shop, this is all about Star Wars, Mandalorian. You got Kylo over there without his helmet on. Mando, Troopers, Obi-Wan, Grogu. Even got Luke here, got the original trilogy of Luke. That's pretty awesome. You got Ignite the Green, Return of the Jedi Luke. That is freaking awesome. You got New Hope, well, original Star Wars, you got Empire, and you got Jedi Vader. Oh, wait, All Travis right. is calling. Yeah, thanks, Sugar. Right. Hey, we're, we're in the smoking area next to Japan. <laughs> There's a smoking area still? This is, there's no smoking. This is what there's it smoking used to be. in here. I like how you're like you're talking on your vlogging camera. This is my vlogging camera. Mama says uh, showing me the behind the scenes Adam's here. here. Come here. <laughs> you should just always talk on the phone when you have the What did you end just up getting, this. Promise? Okay. Have you Show heard me. of a sake box? Is it alcoholic? It's sake. Is okay. sake alcoholic? Yes. I don't know. It I don't is. drink, so I'm, I'm out but, of the loop on this. But one. it's very cool because you get to take it home with you. It's like a little yeah. souvenir, and oh. they'll write whatever you want. So this Comes is with the Kristen's name, right down Main Street, okay. and this is my name, which is Promise, but in Japanese. That, oh, okay. they actually put your name. Yeah, down yeah, there. yeah, yeah, yeah. They do whatever that. you want. They you can get it on there. It could say Adam the Woo, you know. I but like then you that. give me the sake. And yeah. you hit the box. That's kind of neat. You get a little souvenir. <laughs> and I like how you're a true pass holder when you're eating on top of a trash yes. can. Yeah. That's no, what we have, do. It tastes better. For I, some I know, even I if there's a table available, I won't eat on a table. Uh, I only eat on trash cans. Yeah. Friends have a table here and yeah. we're, we're trash canning it up. I'm all about the trash cans. All right, enjoy your sake. Thank you. Um, well, can you be a part of mine? Absolutely. You, you want me to art on you? I would like you to art on me. I'm going to art on you. Everyone's okay, so I take a Sharpie. On me. Okay. Kick me, kick me on the back. Does it say so kick me? Adam Turn around. Here, you guys. Yeah. It says kick me. It does say. Who did the kick me? That was Ryan. Okay. Uh, that mean, that mean guy over there, Ryan. You put kick, you put kick me on the back. Yeah, back Ryan. Over? She said it was okay. I did not. Where are you supposed to kick on your upper back? Don't I guess. Like, <laughs> 
<laughs> Travis can kick her. You're allowed. You're allowed to. Nobody else. Here we go. go. <laughs> I'm gonna art you. Yeah, I'm gonna draw. I'll draw though. something. Okay, here. All right, I gotta say this is probably the best idea of anybody. <laughs> I think you gotta mark. You gotta like put this where you obviously document it for on camera. Yes. But people are gonna start ripping off this idea. I. They're already feel, ripping it off. Yeah. But I, feel I ripped like, it off from being a kid in middle school when you would get all your friends to sign yeah. at the end of the year. I like. It's a great idea. Look at this. I, I, I take your whole arm. You did. <laughs> I appreciate you giving me your arm. I'm gonna get this tattooed, like you directly on my forearm. <laughs> All right. I do want to get this sushi platter, but there is a little bit of a long line for this as well. You see, it kind of stretches over here. But I definitely want to get the sushi and then continue around World Showcase. There it is for $8.75. The sushi donut, salmon, tuna, shrimp, cucumber, sesame seed, decor on the plate, wasabi, and eel sauce. I'm also getting this non-alcoholic blue. Blueberry drink. Thank you. This little, uh, almost looks like a little purple figment drink right here. Oh, thank you. Yes, figment color. Yeah, it's like figment, right? Yes. I like it. Is that blueberry? Yes. Blueberry on there. And then the sushi donut right here. Look at this thing of beauty. All right, Micah, you know you're officially at Epcot. I've stated this like 12 times today. When you're eating at a festival on a trash can. Yep. Right here. You got the figment. We kind of doubled down on this. Yeah. This is what I wanted. Going good. full on the sushi there. I should have picked this up with my hand and ate it. I'm going to get your reaction here. That looks good. Yeah. It's a sushi donut. It's a sushi donut. Sticky rice. We're how much it would cost to get every food item out here. Oh, oh. A couple grand. Oh, yeah. All right, gonna continue on. Gonna head toward past Italy and past Germany, or towards Germany, is continuing the loop. Mickey and Minnie, you and me together forever. Mickey and Minnie. There's Mickey painting Walt. That's kind of clever. Mickey painting Walt. There's figment. There's Walt and Mickey in front of Carthay, DCA. Yeah, take a look at this figment down here. I really like this figment. He's got a little sweater on. There's Mrs. Potts over here. Got the partner statue there. You got the hitchhiking ghost, but it's really just Donald, Pluto, and Goofy down below. There's a tree. This is interesting. Look at this. There's like a little hidden Mickey in that tree right there. There's a loft. And then take a look at these little items. These little sculpture, like little robots right there. There's is a Falstaff Salutes uh, American USA robot. Almost got some uh, kind of steampunk type of style to it. Fancy meeting you both here. Oh, I know. Do you believe Where'd it? you get your popcorn, Amanda? Canada. Oh, oh, check it out. Canada. oh there you go. That's the most exotic uh, food item here at the festival. Right here, popcorn. <laughs> yeah, I mean, Very nice. Get it's all gone. Now it's only for walking from Canada here. It's already Amanda. It. Fancy gone. meeting you both here. Craziness. You're gonna tell me a pun, aren't you? No, no. no. Oh wow, it's your joke, day off. Joke, joke less. Okay. So yeah. <laughs> I, I like that last. You look tired. <laughs> you need a coffee. Okay, buy you a hot coffee. I, 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 I buy you a hot coffee. I want to say this. I normally have more energy, and but I had a weird dream last night, Adam. Yeah. Trump does a muffler in a car. I woke up exhausted. <laughs> I like that video where you did the hard cut and yeah. called Baby Yoda jump. And then I just like, cut it. <laughs> That's it. That's what I do. I won't do that this time. Oh, it's amazing. What is this? It is amazing. It is a banana margarita, but what's the name of it? It's I a smoky no... banana margarita. Okay. It is so good. It is really smoky and it has a really good banana puree flavor to it. Okay. So she, said, she said it tastes like baby food. Kind of like, you know, the jar baby food. Yeah. <laughs> you remember that? <laughs> I remember when I was a baby, yeah. <laughs> you eat a lot of baby food. I love the banana. As an adult. Don't tell anybody. <laughs> yeah. As an adult, she, she, she actually does eat a lot of baby food. But the, but the bananas are <laughs> delicious. Do you ever have the baby food banana? I have. So yeah, good. that's pretty good. I like the banana strawberry mix. Ooh, yeah. you, you mean, you that mean the German? Yes. yes! We all gotta have conversations <laughs> about eating baby food. There is adult food you can eat. You got this. Know. You got this. Do you think oh, it yeah, had this yeah, before? Look at it. Right. Do you regret spending thirty dollars on this? Or oh, never. Yeah, I think it was a good good deal. He's Does really it light cute. up? Is that the button? It for lights yes. up. Yes. yes, he lights up. The um, um, bottom of it, I think, lights up. Yes. Oh my goodness. Bro, and it changes colors like the popcorn. Right. And you know what I like about this bucket is the fact that this time the popcorn is actually in a sealed bag. Yeah, so like it artistic. won't go stale yeah. super fast if you don't want to eat it. Yeah. What, are you gonna, what are you excited about trying, June? Uh, so I'm a little disappointed that there's not like a lot of savory stuff. I've seen a lot of sweets as far as new goes. Right. Oh, yeah. So what I was most excited about trying was the grilled marinated steak. I had that. Okay. 
delicious. Yeah, but that tostada was better. I'm satisfied. The tostada is better than the grill stick? Where's the tostada? Right over here? Yeah. Um, I'm gonna try that. Amazing. It was like chilled lobster on top. Yeah. Oh my gosh, it was so good. It wasn't fishy, nothing. But that's biased. You didn't know I was filming these, did you? No, I didn't know I yeah, did. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> They're talking about fish. By the way, do you know what, uh, what do the fish say when it swam into a wall? Damn. <laughs> <laughs> what did his best friend say? Don't give him a courtesy laugh, what, please. What For the love of God, don't act this antagonist. Don't act this guy on. What, what did his best friend say? <laughs> Dumb bass. Hey! Oh, that is funny. I'll be. Uh, uh, he'll be on y'all week. I'll be on here. Take a look at this. This is pretty cool. So I don't know which one I'm gonna end up getting. That I do like the orange bird here. Nothing rhymes with orange. Steamboat hey. Willie over here. We got Stitch. You ever bought anything from here, Chris? No. But I mean, like, this is interesting to me because they got they got Belle, right? And she's in the green dress. She's right. Her typical dress, and she's reading the Was other. That, is that Christmas Belle? That's Christmas Belle, I think. Yeah, yeah. And she's like, she's reading the other books. She's learning about all the other Disney characters. Yeah, and you got the Beast holding all of them. Yeah. He's like the librarian Beast. Look at this. Look at uh, Figma scaring the crap out of Mickey. He's like, just like looming over him there. <laughs> That's kind, of, it's, back. It's kind of kind of frightening, right? You're a big fan of figment. I love figment. Are you? You like figment? No. You don't like figment. Mm -mm. I don't. I don't. I don't have any any. All right. Let me put this on film. Secrets revealed. Secrets revealed. Chris Provost hates figment. I didn't say. You don't. You don't like him. You're not a fan. Yeah. I just. Well, yeah, yeah, it's not a, I'm a Disneyland guy, and it's not Disneyland. Yeah, fair enough. Do you like Stitch? Yeah, I, I do. Not, Stitch. Here's some good trivia though for you about yeah. Stitch. He's the number two uh, selling merchandise of all Disney. I believe it. Yeah. I've discovered there's two types of Disney animation people. There are people that like Stitch and people that don't. It's like there's two fences. There's two sides. Yeah. The same with Figment. They're kind of Figment, Figment and Stitch should be like buddies because they're they're both loved and disliked by I, equal amounts of people. I think so. Figment seems to be attached to a lot of people's children because they remember coming here with Epcot. I guess it was that Rainbow thing. The Rainbow Tunnel. I've never done that. I've never done that. It's not well. It's you got you've been up in the DVC lounge. You took me there one time. Yeah. Yeah. It's up there. Remember, I, I made the lady mad. You did. Yeah. <laughs> She, she told us like sit over here, and I oh, thought it was a suggestion. Oh, he sat somewhere else. Yeah, yeah. I didn't realize that was that. So fine. she feels the same way about you as you feel yeah. about Figma. Yeah, she's right. just kind of impartial. Yeah, towards yeah. Provost. Dang. And speaking yeah. of Figma, yeah, check out this marsh room right here. I'll tag you. And then over here is some. This is kind of different. This is like non-Disney. It's almost like uh, the ocean. I don't know it has like the ocean sounds, the surfboard. I like this. This is cool. This is a really unique idea. It's a tabletop here, and then below it, where the legs are, you got the dwarfs over here, and then you got Belle and the Beast right over here as well. And you got some villains. This is awesome. Oh, Hades. This is pretty dang awesome. Is that one of your favorite villains? I love Hades so Hades. much. I jumped. I'm sorry. I'm trying to be quiet, yeah. but I was like, ah. It's I pretty, love Hades. So pretty much. good. Who voiced Who voiced Hades? Uh, Think oh, about. It. No, 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 hey, and, and, yeah, yeah. He was in John. Um, James Woods. James, James Woods. Woods. You got and it. And here's the thing: in his contract, he put that he has right of first refusal. Anytime they do Hades, he gets to do the characters first if they if he can because he loved it so much. That's great. And here's some trivia about this: I don't know if you know about Tinkerbell. Yeah, tell me. When they first created Tinkerbell, they had, he had she had a brother. I don't know if you knew that. No, I did not. Know that. Yeah, Taco. Taco Bell. Good lord. That's bad. <laughs> Alright, Chris the girl is also here. She is just arriving. Just arriving. So Tampa J is to sit in this one out? He's not here. He's out of the state. Right okay. Now. So he's yeah, not gonna be part not. of So I have to ask you, do you like Figment? I love Figment. I know someone that's not a big Figment guy, right over there oh, in the corner right there. Wow. Yeah, and uh that's you know he had good. never been on Carousel of Progress till yeah, till like last year. Oh, and he uh oh, secrets God, revealed. <laughs> I mentioned that one time and Adam blasted it out. I got so much guff for that. But well, you're gonna have fun at the you're gonna have fun at the event. There's yeah, a lot of art to I'm see. I'm excited. It's my first time. Yeah, you're you gonna love it. Very pretty so, camera. Thank you. I love I know. the white body. Yeah, and it's it's amazingly still white too. Somehow yeah, yeah. I don't know how, but. And I have put probably 37 vloggers in my video today. Oh, cool. So you're number 38. Check out Chris the Girl on YouTube. All right. All right, monorail going by over there. I'm not really sure how much longer I'm gonna longer I'm gonna stay. I've already done the Epcot, uh, the World Showcase loop, but I might walk around Future World a little bit. All right. I hope I don't mess this up. <laughs> <laughs> 
Oh, wow. Practice. Now he looks evil. Okay. I didn't want him to look evil. Is that Olaf? But I, I, I really can't see. I can't I, tell. I wanted just to give you a Mr. Bluebird, Bluebird. on your shoulder. Oh. I, I know. It was Olaf. I was way but off. Now, <laughs> I thought it was Olaf. Olaf. You think it was Olaf? He needs, he needs I thought another. it was Olaf. It kind of looks like an Olaf. Everybody give me some it's feathers. The nose, right? There feathers. it is. There you go. Let me see. Let me there see. he is. That's there he's good. A bird. Mr. Olaf. <laughs> All right, I'm getting in line now for the soup and sandwich over here at Poppy's. All right, we went with the pimento cheese and tomato soup. Looks like they take that and they slice it down the middle. Yeah, I kind of feel like this needs to be sopped inside the soup. Dude, there's so much flavor. Mike, are you a sopper? Oh, yeah. Or sop it up. You like to sop it up there? Hey, you burn. Or you like to sop your sandwiches? <laughs> I'll be honest, I already had a bite of this. This is like the nectar of the gods dipped a sandwich inside of it. Mm. It's amazing. Now check it out, they're cooking up, they're grilling up all the pimento sandwiches here on this grill right outside of the Pop Eats spot right there. It's freshly grilled and cooked up. I gotta, like I say, I highly recommend the pimento, the grilled cheese sandwich. They're the best I've ever had. See, I'm not the only one that says it's amazing, it was awesome. All right, from here, I think I'm gonna head back over towards the Odyssey, then cross the bridge near Test Track. Maybe try an item over there, check out a couple more booths, and then slowly make my descent and exit out of here at some point. Oh, and check it out, Spaceship Earth is all illuminated over there, as well as the little Festival of the Arts rainbow here. Also all lit up under the Shroud of Nightfall. And a nighttime version of the monorail going by with the green illuminated underneath it, going by Spaceship Earth, which is also illuminated. Nightfall has reared its head. Ooh, that looks really good all lit up right here. Welcome to Oz. Welcome, Welcome to, to Pandora. Oz. Kevin also purchased, you might be the at least the 387,000th person yes. that has bought this. What did you call this thing? Uh, thick Mint. He's, uh, he's very thick. I, I don't know, can you see it with the uh, oh, yeah. I see it. camera? You know, he's, uh, he's in retirement now, yeah. He's got some girth to him. But this, we want to turn this into like a fish tank or have a hamster in there. Okay. Lots of room, nice and spacious. Would you la name the thick, would you name the hamster Th Figment? Yeah, <laughs> I guess. <laughs> I got how chunky it is. And I, I guess he could be thick mitt. It does yeah. look really cool lit up. You need one. But I was thinking how neat it would be to have that ceramic Spaceship Earth. If you see Spaceship Earth over there, you kind of have Spaceship Earth next to it. And you can put a little figment in there. Put a little orange bird in there. Thick yeah, a little orange bird. Now it's a popcorn bucket. They have the popcorn, but like after the fact, how does the popcorn go in there? Does the whole bucket just go in there? I think it's like a just a paper container. You yeah. just dump it in. Do you dump it in, or do you shove the whole box in? Or you can just go one kernel at a time. Depends on what how OCD you are. You know. It is interesting seeing people walk around with these around their neck, though. They are gaudy. Good out of Miami, you got the bling bling on. There you go. Look at that. It does light up your face though. It gives like some good uh you get some good video and photos there. See, you gotta say Adam, get it for the Woodio. For the Woodio? This is what you need. Maybe the this goes on for five weeks, so I got five weeks to make my decision. And I was gonna buy a piece of art today and I didn't buy anything, so I gotta come back to buy some. Oh there you go. Or you got old girthy figment in there. <laughs> You could buy a sculpture. That's your artwork right there. That's true. There you go. So this is the only art you're buying here? Yes. It's the most important thing. That is well like look, when I look at the art, it's like, do I want to live with that for the rest of my life? Like when you're going to the bathroom and Mickey's looking at you. That's true. Yeah. But gotta, that you could live with for the rest oh, of your this, life? Yeah, put this on top of the toilet. That won't end up in a garage sale in two years? <laughs> uh, Lakeland Antique Ball. That's that's where we're at. What the heck is that, Kevin? It's uh, deconstructed BLT. Everything here at this booth is deconstructed. Is this mine? Yeah. All right, thank you. This is a deconstructed strawberry. Strawberry? Mint julep with strawberry puree. Be careful, the pipette may fall out. Yeah, I guess this is basically like a mint julep, but it has the strawberry stuff in this little syringe that you pump in yourself. You have to make it yourself. That's why it's deconstructed. Yeah, you basically, you have to stir this around and then you squeeze it. Yeah, squeeze you Give it a little strawberry. squeeze into there, just like that and yep. that. Oh, I'm constructing the deconstructedness. That's what I said. Work hard. <laughs> I feel like I got some pretty good lighting here and 
paper straw. That look on your face is not, I don't think you approve of the mint, but you got alcohol in your mint julep. Yeah. That's like a hideous face you're making. You don't like the well, taste of it? It's bourbon and mint. I got that. That's what a mint julep is. Bourbon and mint. Oh, wow. It's cold. They put it on basically like a, a, a snow cold. The non-alcoholic version tastes pretty dang tasty. Next time. No. I'm not, a I'm not a bourbon fan. It's just overpowering. It, it, you should have some popcorn with it. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna have this space food over here. We're gonna have a. That's pork belly, apparently. Yeah. It looks good. Very art, artistic looking. All right, heading out now. So yeah, this came in a non-alcoholic version. That's the one I got. It also came in one with a little, a little booze in it. So. I'm gonna call today. I'm gonna head out of here. Even have some artistic renderings of Spaceship Earth over here they put up on the wall and the real Spaceship Earth right there. And that's gonna do it for today from Epcot Center. Opening day of Festival of the Arts. I'll see you in the next video. The vlog is over. I'm driving it. Also, bonus footage. I was gonna buy some art and I didn't. Means I gotta come back over the next five weeks. Maybe buy that figment bucket and maybe buy some art. Today was pretty overwhelming, but a lot of fun. A lot of fun.